Hi everyone, welcome to my crazy crafty life. Today I have another timing haul, so let's jump into it. Okay, so I found a bunch of stuff on Temu and I'm excited. I can't believe all the stuff that I have to show you. I'm going to put my discount code if you are new and you have not shopped on this site before. Give it a try. It's awesome. And you'll get 30% off your very first order with that code. So the first thing I have is 548. It's in this box. Um, I can't remember. Okay, this is this is what I got. Okay, it's a cute little strawberry pen holder or whatever you want. I mean, it doesn't have to be. It's acrylic. Um, is there a film on this? There is, ooh, there is a protective film on this. So that's why it might look cloudy or a little off, but that is what it looks like. I think it's adorable. I don't have links for all this stuff, but if you ask me, I'm more than happy to send you the links. Um, it's not too hard to navigate that site though. Honestly, there's so many things on there, but if you type in um, pencil holder or pen holder, strawberry, it probably will show up <laughs> if they still have it in stock. But don't give up because they restock things all the time. So the next um, strawberry item I found were these socks and they are $1.29. Super, super cute. Um, oh my gosh, I cannot wear, wait to wear these. How cute are these and fun I love fun socks and they feel really nice quality really nice quality so nice and thick so they should hold up pretty well I think the next item I have is this ring set it was sterling silver and I was just curious about like the quality and how nice it would be this was 24 48 a little pricey but when you consider what it is, um, I mean, it's not bad. It's basically like a wedding set. It's adjustable though at the bottom, but you get like the solitaire and this little princess crown. Hopefully my camera is showing that well enough. Um, see there's the solitaire so you could wear just that by itself and it fits in here and then let me see if I put it on it might be easier to see I'm gonna put it on my pointer finger to show you but that is what it looks like on don't focus on me, camera. Focus on the ring. <laughs> so that's what that looks like. I think it's really cute. And um, yeah, so I'm happy with it. The next thing I got, it was a mold. It's um, It was 38 cents, which is cheap, really cheap. But it's a little heart. And it has a raised heart so that when you make the heart, it has a heart-shaped cutout. So you could turn this into like a key ring, a necklace, whatever you want. Super cute, 38 cents. I got another strawberry item, shocker, <laughs> $3.48. And it's one of these like fidget popper things. <laughs> and I love it. I think it's really cool. It's double sided too, so I love that. So you can pop them all in. And then um, it has this cute little hanger and it has a star on there so you could hook it onto a bag or whatever. Um, probably a little too big for keys. I don't know. Some people might not mind that, but when you're done, when you've pushed them all in, you just squeeze it and they all pop right back out again and you can start over. I love this thing. <laughs> it's addicting. So uh, very addicting. I love this. The next thing I got were these little tiny um, storage boxes. I do a lot of crafts. Um, I have a lot of jewelry. <laughs> I have 
so many little tiny things that I can organize. So I got a big package of these. I don't know how many. I wish I'd written it down. Um, 40 pack. Oh, it says it. 40 pieces on here. It's really tiny, though. You won't be able to see, I don't think. But you get these little tiny boxes that hopefully snap together. How does this work? There we go. <laughs> okay, so they just snap. You just have to give it a good push. And then they have like this double. So then you just open it like that. I hope ex I explained that well enough, but let's see. And it has a really good snap. So whatever you put in here, earrings, whatever, will hopefully stay safe. Earrings, rings, um, especially if you're traveling. I was even thinking pills. Um, might work well in here i don't know but yeah this, this is really cool i got 40 of them so i have plenty for a, a lot of different things the next thing that i picked up was this like tile i think they called them Euro european tiles uh roman style textured tile 13.77 by 27.38 it was a dollar 88 and I'm going to take it out of the packaging, I think. I got this to craft with. Um, it shows them putting it on a wall. I mean, this was only $1.88. Man. And it's a good size. I mean, look how big that is. And you get all these different, like, looking tiles. Which I thought was really cool. Like I said, I want to just frame these and put them somewhere as decor. Um, but it also has a sticky back. So you peel this back and stick it on the wall. It feels like foam. It really feels like foam. But I like how it looks kind of like pearlized. Just the only way I can explain it. It's not iridescent, but it's definitely got a shiny feel and look to it um really pretty i just love the patterns i love this kind of stuff um it makes me think victorian i especially love that one so i love these i wish i could do my whole ceiling <laughs> in these type of tiles but i think what i want to do is just frame it and hang it up somewhere i'm not sure yet or maybe I won't frame it. Maybe I'll just put it on something like a canvas of some type and put it on the wall. I don't know yet. I haven't figured it out, but I think these are awesome. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. And it comes like this. The next item that I got was from my craft room. It was $3.99. It's a tin sign. Um, but I was confused because honestly, I saw it and I thought, I don't know what I thought for $3.99. <laughs> I got it and it said this. Um, I really love this sign. I do. But it says your names craft room. <laughs> and the your names is actually like printed on. I thought that, that was just on the sample and that they gave you letters maybe to put on there. Or I would have preferred it to just be plain because I can easily take my Cricut and put my own name on there but what I might do um I don't know I'm gonna have to get creative I guess because it says your names so I may have to um paint over that or do something and then do the Cricut with my name on it but I think the sign is really adorable so it was only $3.99 <laughs> okay so the next item that I got was $4.94 it is this like file folder type deal. <laughs> it comes with stickers, which I like. It's very nice. Um, you can handwrite or use a label maker, whichever. Um, let me open this up. I like that it's going this way. Um, a, it's unique. B, if you wanted to put it in like a backpack for whatever reason, you could carry all of your important things in here. Um, I'll probably just use it for home to organize paperwork, but it literally 
Or, I mean, maybe I'll use it for stickers or crafts because this is actually really, really nice. I like this. And you do have these little labels that you can stick on with whatever you want to put. So this is neat. I like it. And it's um, nicely reinforced at the top. So if you're carrying it around and also to all these files extend up all the way across so you could put the stickers wherever you want so if you want them to be staggered you can do that if you want them to be all on the same side you can do that so i like that i like that they're giving you that option so not bad not a bad deal how much is that 4.94 i mean this is really nice and it's a nice sturdy plastic so and see-through too so you could see um, if you wanted to put like a, a cover here with what it what's inside of it you could also do that so if you had several of these you would know so if you had one for like household if you had one for appliances um, if you had one for family members um, yeah I think this is really awesome or you know if you do if you do um, put your crafts in here you could maybe do one for like Christmas fall and I do believe they had other colors in this so this is very nice I like it the next item that I got were these boots and I thought I put the price oh yeah these were 13 18 a little pricey I got the largest ones these are like little kids ones I wanted to use these to put flowers and honestly that's what I got them for. Um, I could not find like any inexpensive or on clearance ones that I liked and I saw these and I really did like them so I got them. Um, they are a little, they need a little help so I may have to like shove bags in here and kind of stretch this out again because it's a little squashed. Let's see maybe this one's not as bad. This one's not as bad. Um, but yeah, I thought I was going to put like little florals in here and set them out for the fall. Or the fall, the spring. <laughs> you know, spring, April showers bring May flowers. <laughs> and I just thought these were adorable for that. So just picture some cute little pink flowers. Yeah, and I think I saw some at Dollar Tree and now I'm kicking myself because I should have got them. And they would have been perfect because I think they were this color but they were like a light pink and a dark pink together so I think they would have looked adorable with this um so yeah I I mean a little pricey but I got the biggest size they had so while we're on the subject of little kids <laughs> um oof, this is funny this is so silly they had this magic wand but then they have like a whole set you could buy just the wand um but I got the whole set because I was curious and the whole set was I put the price on here somewhere <laughs> $9.98 so you get this wand and how many of you have gone to like Disney on Ice and seen these wands they are a lot more than a $9.98. Okay. Um, and they had other colors. Oh my gosh, I can't get this out. Okay, they had other colors. Um, this does take batteries. I don't think it has, does not have batteries in it right now. So I will have to do a demonstration. Of you have gone to like Disney on ice or what have you and seen everybody with this kind of stuff and was like man that is so expensive I don't want to pay that <laughs> so I picked this up because I thought it was adorable for that kind of thing also great for little kids I mean 998 that's not bad 
Um, and not only did you get this, which I think this alone is worth that, you get a little crown. <laughs> a little crown. How cute. Um, I know I'm not going to be able to put all this stuff on myself, but then they had the little earrings, their clip-ons, but you could also craft with these, I feel like, so if you didn't want them for that reason. Um, the earrings, okay, here's the necklace, which is super short. Goodness, who, who can wear that? But there's the necklace, adorable. Again, could craft with it. I'm going to put all these in here so I don't lose any of it. <laughs> There's the crown. I don't want to lose any of that stuff. So cute. And they give you the gloves, which probably will not fit me, but still super cute. I love that pattern too, so I feel like maybe I'll want to craft with these somehow. Super cute. And then they give you the mask, which, you know, again, this is all like pretend play stuff. It's so cute, especially if you have a girly girl that loves pink um, or whatever colors they have. I think they have other colors. Um, I think this just ties in the back. It's not an elastic, so... And actually, it kind of fits me. I don't think the string will reach, but that can be easily fixed. Oh, I like that. I'm going to have to wear that like at Halloween or something. That is so cute. I love that. How pretty. Look at the detail. This is not the $1.25 ones that you get at Dollar Tree. This is really nice. And it's like a molded plastic, so it's quite comfortable. And then they had the little tutu skirt, which is adorable. I don't think it's going to fit me, but I still think it's pretty. And I could definitely see myself doing something creative with it. Or is it a cape? I feel like it's supposed to be a skirt, though. I, f I don't know. It's kind of long. I feel like it could be. It's actually a cape. So maybe I can wear it like that, you know, kind of thing. <laughs> that would be adorable. And, you know, for Halloween, like, I don't, like, I'm an old lady. I don't do all that stuff anymore. <laughs> but something like this I would totally do. So how cute. How stinking cute. And now I ruined my hair, but that's all right. <laughs> I totally wrecked my hairdo. Okay. All right, here we go. <laughs> That's cute. I kind of like it, and maybe I'll wear it for the rest of the time. Who knows? <laughs> I think it's so cute. And if you wanted to, you could use it as a curtain. I mean, you could get creative with the stuff, I'm sure. So it's just, you know, tool, and it has little, like, starbursts on it and glittery stuff. So I think that's cute, and I would totally wear I would totally wear this. I totally wear it this package of 12 for $19.29. They are flags, outdoor flags. And $19.28 for 12. I mean, it's ex it's a little pricey, but these are really heavy duty, um, like canvas type, maybe even like a burlap, but like a tightly woven burlap, which is really nice. And they had, they are double-sided, which is really nice. Um, can I see through them? I mean, just a little, but depending on where you put them, you probably won't be able to. So they had that. And they had this one. They had the, keep in mind, this all comes in the package. I love this one ball. This one's really cute too. The be 
that's so cute um oh my gosh the lemons how sweet i love these this one easter just passed how cute is this happy easter happy spring so you could still keep it up through the month of april which i might do um i don't know how well these will do outside but i guess we'll find out <laughs> Um, happy Thanksgiving. I don't know. These are just too pretty. Maybe I won't put them outside. But these are really, really cute. Um, this one. This is going up next. So cute. Look at that. These are amazing. Look at this one. Super cute. And I feel like, you know, if you didn't like all of these, you could definitely gift them for sure. And I love this one too with the roses, so pretty. So yeah, and all those options, like I think those are really nice. These are really nice quality. These are the kinds that you'd probably get at like Hobby Lobby and stuff, so. Very nice, I like it. <laughs> the next item that I got, it was $6.29. Oh, $6.29. <laughs> um, and it is this little metal sign. It says coffee, and I think it's adorable. I just had to have it. It's metal. It's got the little holes so you can hang it. How sweet and cute is that? I love it. I love, love, love this. Super cute. For $6.29, it's not bad. It's really heavy duty too, so I feel like it will last. The next item I got was $3.78, and it's a bunny steak. Um, it is plastic, but I liked it because it kind of looks metal. Um, it's for outdoors, but honestly, I don't think I would use it that way. I think I would use it inside. There is a film on this, so it does look cloudy, but it's acrylic. Let's see, I'll show you real quick. See, it's super shiny acrylic underneath that film but look at that pattern I love the bunny pattern so so cute and I really think I would take this off and just put it you know um, near a tiered tray or near a flower arrangement of some kind I would not probably use this outside I just think it's too pretty um, but you could because it's plastic um, I don't know, we've had a lot of wind lately and I feel like this would just blow away and I'd be so scared to lose it because it's so cute. But it was only $3.78, so... I mean, as long as you're okay with losing it, you know, I guess I'd be all right. And I think they had other styles, but this is the one I loved. I also thought in a wreath, like the center of a wreath, this would be adorable. So another option too. So if you did want to use it on your outdoor wreath, I might do that instead. Um, I could, you know, use some like um, zip ties and like just kind of secure it in there, especially with all these little holes and things. I could probably uh, fish through some some way to secure it to a wreath. So excited about that. Very excited about that. Okay, I then got some wood rounds and honestly... These were $7.19. Honestly, I was just curious what the quality was. Um, these are really pretty. $7.19, are you kidding me? They're big. These are the size of a regular wreath. Um, I got this one with the white. Um, and, and I mean, it, like any floral, like any bow, you're going to have to fluff it up and, and make it look pretty. It does come with the twine. Um, the only thing I will say is if you are going to put this outside, I feel like this side is fine. It, it, there is a finish on here, um, but the back is plain, so I'd be scared to just have it out there. Um, but how cute is that? And they also had it in the black, which I got both. Tell me why I got both. <laughs> um, I actually want to put this um, in my downstairs, I think, the white one, and then the black one. I'm not sure yet. I'm not sure yet where I'm going to put all these, but I was very curious, and for $7.19, I could not believe it, and the quality is actually pretty cute and pretty decent, so I like the bow a lot, so very excited. 
the greenery and the bow on there. And the black one's the same. So cute. The next one that I got, um, this one was $4.98. Not bad at all. Um, I will say I'm not as ecstatic about this one as I was about the other two. But I feel like there's a lot of potential here. And that's what it looks like. And that's the back. And I feel like you could, you know, put different greenery on here, change it up. You could change maybe this love because it just kind of blends in. Um, and maybe put a metal one from Dollar Tree or, I don't know, do something else. Maybe with the Cricut. I feel like this is really pretty, but this just doesn't, I feel like it doesn't match like the red bow with the pink, like I feel like they just kind of threw it together. But I definitely think there's a lot of potential here and I'm excited to play around with it and make it look uh, a lot better. <laughs> I love the lace piece in the center here. So yeah, definitely. I mean, I love it. I think it's beautiful. I just think they could have done a little more to make it look... Uh, more intentional I guess more more like it just you know I don't know it looks printed it, there's no layers there's no heart layer here like I feel like I could put a layer there you know I feel like the greenery could be a little more fuller <laughs> maybe um, maybe a different bow you know that kind of thing I, I like it I just don't think it's a hundred percent there but for $4.98, I'm not going to complain too much. Next item I got, I thought was stained glass and I thought it was larger. So I was a little surprised when I got it. It was teeny teeny tiny. Um, I'm not sad about it. It was $4.48. Um, but it is really pretty. It does look like stained glass. It's like hard plastic. I don't know. The back feels kind of metal it's just black in the back um yeah I don't know I don't know and it does feel textured like a stained glass maybe would be uh, but it's not real stained glass it just looks like it it's meant to hang like in a window I guess it's just a little cute little thing um I might just use it as an embellishment of some kind. I haven't decided. I think it's really pretty. I wish it was a real stained glass window. Um, obviously, it wasn't going to be for $4.48, but I thought it would be a little bit larger for sure, at the very least, and I thought it would be like faux stained glass. Um, I'm not totally sad about it. I don't hate it. It just wasn't what I was expecting. But yeah, it's cute, and maybe you could turn it into a magnet. For the fridge or something I don't know I know I'll I'll keep it and do something with it um, but yeah 448 for that I, I'm mixed feelings I will say that <laughs> mixed feelings so I found some earrings and they were two dollars and sixty cents um, for the black and the gold is really yellow so I'm not a huge fan of it I do love the design of it. Um, it's just a little more yellow than I was thinking it would be. I feel like maybe I could do some antiquing to it or something um, and change it up. I don't know yet, but they're really pretty. I do like them. And then I found the green ones and those were $2.89. Why they were two different prices, no clue. But here are the green ones. And emerald is my birthstone, so I really, really liked them. Again, the yellow, though, I don't know how I feel. <laughs> I may I may keep it just because, I don't know, it's different, but it is really, really bright. But yeah, that's what they look like. Hopefully you can really see that. Here's the black. Ooh, there's the black ones. And the green. So pretty. So I then got some scrapbook paper. This was a dollar sixty-nine. It's six by six paper. Um, I didn't even look at the size when I saw it. I was like, oh wait, that's small. Um, but I still wanted to get it because you know, scrapbook paper, I, I like to do that stuff. 
Um, and I liked the paper patterns. So you get all these. I'll show them to you separately. It says, it's a good weight too. So that's surprising. Get this one. Get this one. I think you only get one of each design. Is that what it says? 12 designs. Yeah, so you get one of each. So I probably should have bought two packs if I wanted two of each. Um, I love the plaid. That's pretty. Nice neutral. This floral is so pretty. That one's really pretty too. Very, very pretty. Great for crafts. So very excited for this. I love these. This this is really pretty too. I love that. And then there's that one. So yeah, so you get 12, one of each. Um, not a terrible deal for a dollar sixty-nine. I mean, honestly, craft store, I mean this paper is thick, so you would probably pay. I don't know. I don't know how much you would pay for these, but I know craft paper is expensive. Um, it's plain on the back, but still, it's a good weight. It's not super, super thin. So well, this ring I'd seen a long time ago um, on Tiffany's, and I always wanted one, always. But, you know, the price is insanity. So I did find this one for three oh five, dollars And it looks like this. And I'm probably going to have to show a close-up picture. Jewelry is so hard to show. <laughs> um, but it has little X's, gold X's, and then little um, gemstones in between. Um, obviously, the quality, I mean, it, you can tell it's not designer quality. But um, it's really pretty. It is really pretty. And I got it for my ring finger. Um, I have to take these off. Okay, so it does fit this hand. So pretty. Let me put on. So that's what it would look like on, um, you know, with another stone. I think it's cute. Um, is the quality perfect? No, <laughs> no. Um, but I'm happy with it for the price. It's all right. So that was three oh five. Um, this is a pair of earrings, and sometimes you just want a little stud. And I thought these were really cute, and I know I'll wear these. And I think they call them cherry blossoms. Does it say here? It just says stud earrings and they were $1.58 and they're little flowers. How sweet and cute are those? Why, why focus on, focus on the flower please, camera. <laughs> this is so hard to do, really it is. Um, but it's a little flower, five petal flower. Super, super cute. I love them. Let's see. This is $4.48. I don't know what it is. What is this? Oh, I remember now. Okay, so I got a little like crystal hanging. I do love to hang these things from my window. I may even do it in my car. I don't know. I haven't decided. But how pretty is that? It's like an agate piece. It's purple. And then it has this cute little crystals. I will say that in the picture they had purple to match this and for some reason I got blue. I don't hate it. <laughs> I'm not mad about it. It's still really pretty. Um, but yeah, this is so cute. I love this. So I will say that, um, you know, if you're expecting it to match, it may not. Still really pretty though. I like it. You know, this would match my bathroom, this color down here. So I'm not mad. <laughs> I'm not mad at all. Thank you, Timu. <laughs> um, or Tamu, Timu, I don't know. Why don't we just potato, potato, whatever comes out of my mouth is what it is. <laughs> okay, the next thing that I got, it was $2.24. I think might end up being a return 
it's these little hair things. I got a red, a white, and a black for the two twenty-four. So that's less than a dollar each. Oh my! It's falling on me. Um. So you put this, you put your hair through here, and then you like wrap your hair, and then this twist that's wired. Um, but it didn't stain my hair very long. Like I put it on and it stayed for like a couple minutes and then it fell over. And I tried to fix it, I tried to play with it, and I no matter what I did, it didn't work. So I'm not happy with these. I will tell you that. I I'm kind of sad because I, you know, I'd seen these a while ago and I wanted to try them, but they just don't work. So or they don't work in my hair, maybe if I had coarser hair. I don't know. I just don't know. I don't know. The other thing that I got for my hair is this bun holder or maker, bun maker. Um, there's actually directions on this one and shows you. Um, and I did see somebody try this. I think it was a Twisted Gypsy. So I was intrigued. They kind of are like those slap bracelets. So it opens up, you put your hair in and then you wrap it. And then it, I think you just, I don't even know. How the heck you do this? I don't know. It's not even bending. What? Am I doing it the wrong way, maybe? I don't know. I'm going to have to play with this, I guess. Oh, it goes this way. Okay, I was trying to snap it the other way. All right, so I feel like this one has more potential. Um, should I try it? I wonder if I should try it. Okay, let's try it. <laughs> it may not work. It might be a total fail. But let's try. Let's try. We don't know until we try. Actually, I have a hair thing back here, too. Oh, my gosh. All right, don't mind my nasty, <laughs> my nasty hair. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe I'm doing this on camera. Okay, I'm going to change my mind, I think. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Okay. So you put your hair. See, this is the problem I have. My hair falls out. So you twist your hair. <laughs> I already snapped it on one side. Stay. Oh my God. No, this isn't going to work. <laughs> See, this is not something I can do. Yeah, no, it's already falling out. So, I, let's see, I don't know. I don't know about these things. They're so gimmicky. They look great. And then you try them. I don't know. I don't think I have the right kind of hair. My hair is not very thick. So I don't know. Maybe this isn't going to work for me, but you never know. Uh, this one, I at least want to try again. Probably not on camera <laughs> when I'm able to, you know, do it with some patience. But this is what it looks like. It's really cool. I mean, I like the concept. So the other ones, I just felt like they weren't going to work for me at all. Again, I just don't have to care. It's not going to work. <laughs> it's just not going to work. The next item I found was this. And I was curious <laughs> because, so this cost, how much did this cost? $4.49. I'd seen this like on one of those facebook ads i don't know those ads that you see all the time that they want to sell you stuff it comes with this little organza bag you get the little kabuki looking foam makeup brush thing it's foam um like a beauty blender type thing um and then you get this and i want to show you how to open it because i had no clue and i almost broke it um, I actually did break it a little, just a little, because I had no clue how it opened. I thought you snapped it open, but no, you turn it like this. Um, yeah, <laughs> and there's your stuff. There's a protector on here, which I probably should not have put on there, but I did. And here is your makeup. And then I just want to do a little, but you see everybody, you know, tap, tap, tap. There's your product. And then they put it on and it like covers. Oh my gosh, this is, 
I'm gonna have to blend this and okay I'm not doing a good job of showing this <laughs> but it's supposed to make your skin look flawless and that's I mean it, that's what it claims and that's what it shows and I'm trying to make it look I mean it looks a lot better <laughs> I didn't wear makeup today so um and I got it all pretty much all the product off of here so it's on my skin it does work um when I tried it and I wasn't like trying to do it on the camera <laughs> it worked really really well so I like it I think I will keep it <laughs> and use it um but if you get this don't do what I did <laughs> it just turns and uh, I may have to get another one I feel like I will be using this a lot more um because this is definitely I like easy stuff I don't I can't do difficult products you know and it, and it all comes in a nice little box for you so okay the next item that I have I bought and it came like this and I couldn't even remember what the heck it was I was looking at this and I was like what is this a book like what is this supposed to be and it's like a felt material like I was so confused <laughs> I was so confused um but this is definitely a very useful thing to have because you unfold it and it holds your baits baseball caps you put them in here and you can hold a whole bunch and they come in like doubles and triples as well um i only got the single and i probably should have got the double um so i may end up ordering and then you know giving this away but yeah because i have a lot of baseball caps and i even ordered someone to move that are coming so um yeah <laughs> so cute though right um and i you can hang this up in your closet or on the wall or whatever and it holds all your hats so i thought that was really neat i got another hair accessory it's a hair bow it was a dollar eight cheaper than dollar two my pile of Timu stuff is falling. Timu, Timu. It's a bow. How cute is that? Um, it's a little wrinkled. It needs to be like, you know, fixed <laughs> a little bit. Um, but, you know, I think this is so cute. You put it in the back of your hair. I'd probably just put like some of my hair up with this. Um, and it has this giant clip, so you could probably fit quite a bit in here, especially if you have thicker hair. Um, usually what I do is I'll use a hair tie and then put this over it uh, because my hair is not thick enough to hold up this clip. So really cute. I like it. And it, it was only eight. so Whew. I hope you're doing well and um, sitting tight <laughs> and... Um, all of those things this is going to be quite a bit lengthy bit video for sure um okay so the next thing i got it was a dollar 52 is these cute little earrings they're hoops they're very very pretty um i think they're supposed to be like butterflies or something i think they look like butterflies um the only complaint i feel like on these is that they're not the pattern is not on the back so if you wear these facing out um i feel like you're gonna get i don't know i don't know how that's gonna work but they do have like a left and a right so you know that's good too i'm happy about that um i like these a lot i can see myself wearing them and they have kind of like a turquoise look in the center which my youngest, no, my middle daughter is turquoise. All my daughters are blue stones, um, but my youngest is turquoise. So I kind of like these a lot and I could see myself wearing them quite a bit. And yeah, so these are really cute. Okay, the next earrings I got, they are a dollar seven. They are these little flower. Oh my gosh, how am I gonna show that?
Hold on. <laughs> oh my goodness. I will say the packaging, you know, is all right, but not perfect for showing things for sure. Um, for sure. But look, they're little flowers and they look like kids drawings. They're really pretty. I'm going to have to show a picture because this is just not doing it justice. But how cute are these? And I love little kids drawings. So these are perfect. Right up my alley. Love them. The next earrings I got are sterling silver and they were $4.04. Now I'm going to be honest. I thought they were bigger, but that's okay because stud, stud earrings are stud earrings. And I'm definitely going to wear these probably on my second holes. I have three. So um, I usually wear like three earrings. And so I may change these little diamonds. And I have like these um, pinkish red ones up there. So these are like a little purple iridescent. Well, not iridescent. Um, I feel like they have kind of like a, a darker purple, lighter purple. I don't know. Two shades of purple, we'll say. And they're really, really pretty. And they're sterling silver, which the ones on my second holes are. So I feel like these will be fine in my ears. And I think they're beautiful. And yeah, they have real backings, not the rubberized ones that they usually give you. Um, so these are these are actually really nice earrings. For $4.04, .04, you're getting sterling silver stud earrings. What? That? I'm blown away by that but these are beautiful very very beautiful so okay I got another makeup item it was a dollar 52 um it's a little it's like a two-in-one and <laughs> I love like you know when people do the little wings but and I tried to do it last week and I wasn't very good at it <laughs> I mean, I don't know if anybody really is. I, I don't know. But this has a little stamp. It says double eyeliner pencil. So it has... Um, oh my gosh. These are so hard to open. Um... Okay, so one side, it says, um, hold on, I need to get my glasses. <laughs> oh my gosh, yes, I'm blind as a bat. <laughs> All right, this says eyeliner here. So you get that tip. And then this says seal eyeliner. I don't know why I call it, they call it that, but it has a little like triangle that makes the tip, the like little wing tip. And I got the classic. So if you're looking for this, there's two different types. There's one that's more dramatic. I just got the classic. And I am not going to try it out because I can't see what I'm doing. I'm going to be honest. <laughs> um, yeah, I can't see what I'm doing. So which is why I have these. Um, but, <laughs> um, sorry I nudged you there, whoops. Okay, but yeah, so if you're looking for this, this is what it looks like. There's, what is it supposed to look like when you're done? I think she even did one on the inside. I don't think I'd go that far, <laughs> but very cool. Okay, I did a lot of strawberry items, so I'm definitely going to finish this haul with a strawberry earrings. These are like strawberry shortcake earrings and not the character. These are actual like food earrings, <laughs> which is so cute. I mean, oh my gosh, how cute is this? All right, so this is what it looks like. They're stacked up and I just think they're cute. They're super cute, I love these. And they were 89 cents. So come on, 89 cents, are you kidding me? That is phenomenal. And it kind of looks like, 
one is broken actually oh that's a little on the sad side okay so we might have to touch that up with some red see right there um but here's one that doesn't have that see it's all red at the top so i may have to just touch it up a little but how cute are these i mean i don't think it matters there's white so somebody could easily think it's like whipped cream so not a big deal but how cute are those 89 cents wow anyways that is it for this Timo haul i hope you enjoyed it if you did give me a thumbs up and a comment down below it really does help me out if you are new here please 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 consider subscribing it really does help me out a great deal i love and appreciate each and every one of you thank you so much for watching and i'll see you next time bye guys